A teenager wanted in a Garland double murder is now in custody, awaiting to be brought back to North Texas. Federal police tracking him down in Mexico. Maria Guerrero has new information on the investigation. This 16 year old fugitive murder suspect is back on U.S. soil and behind bars. Amancio Anton Noris will soon return to Garland to face capital murder charges in the January 14th shooting death of a 17 and 18 year old. Garland police getting word Thursday night U.S. Marshals out of Laredo arrested the teen near Monterey, Mexico. We're ecstatic that we're able to get the 16 year old murder suspect off the street. You know, this just goes to show the, the work that the detectives put into it, identifying the, the suspect, who he is, uh, as well as ultimately what led to getting him into custody. As for the motive, police will only say detectives believe the meetup between the victims and suspect involved high risk activity. If charged as an adult, indicted, and the case goes to trial, it is all but certain the death penalty would be off the table because of a long-standing extradition agreement between Mexico and the U.S. And, and no other arrests expected, or I mean, did someone help him? Or? Our belief is obviously that somebody did assist him to get to the border, uh, but once again, it's still ongoing. We're going to hopefully determine exactly what led to that, to transport things to that effect, to uh, kind of give us a little closure. But ultimately, what we are ecstatic about is giving the family's closure. Police say it could take several days to get him back to Garland to face a judge. Maria Guerrero, NBC5. Normally, juveniles are not identified, but a judge allowed the release of the teen suspect's name and photograph citing the severity of the crime.